Last time we got our fragment profile set up here and ready to go. Now I want to kind of get it ready, get the bottom navigation view set up, get the toolbar set up, and get the widgets in this fragment. So uh, let's see here. We'll start by doing the bottom navigation view because that's going to be easiest. Um, actually, I'll just write it all the widgets. So private text view. There's going to be a whole bunch. M posts. There'll be M followers, M following, M display name, M username, M website, and M description. Then we have the progress bar, and progress bar. We have a circle image view for the profile photo. And we have, a, we're gonna have a grid view for the grid view, obviously. I'm just gonna call it grid view, private toolbar for the toolbar. And image view, uh, the profile menu. Whoops, I want a capital on that guy and private bottom navigation view, bottom navigation view. Okay, now down in on create. Oh, this is so much fun. Log D, uh, actually I don't wanna log it. Well, yeah, I can log it it's starting. It started and then go back up here. Display name, text view, view find view by ID r.id. I think it's called display name. Uh, so and username. Text view view find view ID r.id. Username and website. And description. This video is going to be very boring. Uh, if you don't want to just watch me type, well, actually I'm going to do some stuff at the end, so you're kind of screwed. you got to watch me. Profile photo equals text view, find me by, or just fast forward to when I finish uh, just typing all this out right here because it's pretty boring. Profile photo and posts. So text view, oops. View from vbd dot text view posts and followers. What's going on up here? Oh, I, that's the image view. I think. What is this? No, circle image view. And followers is a text view. Oops. Text view. View find vbd rid dot text view followers and following. Text view, view, find view by the r .id dot text view follow, following, and we got progress bar, progress bar equals progress bar, view, find view by the r .id dot, probably called progress bar. Actually, I think it's called profile progress bar, but let's double check. Profile progress, progress bar, yep. Okay, and then let's do the grid view. So grid view, ID dot grid view and toolbar. Uh, profile toolbar probably. And then profile, <coughs> profile menu. Oh, that's an image view. View, find ID, r .id dot profile menu. And are we done? Bottom navigation view, we gotta do that. Bottom navigation view, ex, r .id dot bottom nav, I think it's bottom nav view bar. I think, let's uh, double check that. So go into, it should be. I don't think I, there's only one, so yeah. Okay, that was a lot of widgets.
Now I actually want to set up the bottom navigation view. So I'm going to copy all that there and I'm going to bring it into here, but we need to change it a little bit since we're in a fragment, it's going to be a little different. Um, we don't need this because we already set that up. Uh, we need to import some stuff here. Um, that is, did I change the name of it? Yeah, I did. Okay. And the activity number. So we're going to need to declare a global just like we did up here for the activity number. And let's get that guy just below the tag here. And we need the context still. So let's create the context. So private context and context. And import that and go down here. Do m context equals get activity for the fragment. And that is once again bottom navigation view, bottom navigation view. Okay, so then we'll call that in on create. And one last thing, I just want to set up the toolbar before we end this, this video. So we'll private void. Uh, actually, I can probably copy it from over here. Set toolbar, yeah. So let's copy this guy here and paste and then get rid of those comments and let's see okay so we're gonna have to change a bunch of stuff this is just m profile should be profile menu yeah but not this profile menu so if i delete that there we go and import intent and to set the action bar we have to actually reference profile activity uh so get activity and then set support action bar and then pass our toolbar and my toolbar is angry wrong okay so it's saying I have, I have the wrong toolbar library so I'm gonna have to go up here uh, find the toolbar library that I imported which is this one we'll delete it and we need to get the new one which is the v7 or v I think it was v7 I just saw and there we go so that will take care of that error and then we can uh, set up the toolbar okay so that's actually all I want to do here I just want to set this up uh, we still will test it though just to make sure it's working properly and uh, now in the next one though when, when we get this working properly we're actually going to start grabbing information from Firebase and populating the profile with it so it's not going to be just fake data anymore it's going to be real data that we're getting from uh, Firebase database whoops from the Firebase database here so grabbing this information okay so let's check out the profile and there we go so it's working that's good there's no issues the toolbar or the bottom navigation view is working I can still click it that's great uh, toolbar is set up I can click this uh, it actually does navigate us to the account settings screen which is good uh, I didn't hide the loading bar which I still need to do but we still need to set up all the widgets and actually get the information from Firebase still so this is good this is a good place to stop and in the next one like I said we're gonna actually start getting information from Firebase so I'll see you guys in the next video